there, Stampers and Crafters, and welcome to the Stamp and Scoop Show. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, I guess we gotta fix that. I can't see Linda's head. So, welcome to the Stamp and Scoop Show. We're back. I'm gonna let Linda take over. Because we don't have a producer or a video guy here to help us out. Like, where Let's see if we can get her. Let's see if we can get her not cut off. All right. Welcome. Oh, oh that? that's good. That's good. You ready? That's good. Oh, okay. I actually have space to hold what I have. Like, we, can we see Excellent. you? Excellent. <laughs> I gotta jump up now. <laughs> this is the <laughs> team of the Navy. <laughs> I know, we did say we were going to do that, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the, t- I'm the Amy to her Tina. It is, it is Tuesday at noon, and welcome to the Stamp and Scoop Show. Live. Live. Live on Facebook. Woo! So... <laughs> People so, are like, what did we I just know, join like, in oh on? Oh my gosh, what's happening? <laughs> good times. So it's always a good time on the show. That's what we're here for, right? <laughs> so welcome. welcome. Welcome to the show, everybody. We have an awesome show today. We are going to be showcasing the Waterfront stamp set, which is in the Occasions catalog. And everyone is loving the set. It is amazing. Everybody's talking about the stamp set. I said, we have to do it. Yeah. We've got to play with this. And boy, I tell you what. I have to say, I was a little intimidated with so the was stamp I, set. Which I find odd. I not usually. <laughs> I had it. I had it. I bought it. And then I just went, uh, I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm afraid. Yep. And so I finally said, okay, we have to do this. So I sat down, opened it up, and oh my gosh, this so set easy. is awesome. Yeah. It is such a great set. Yeah. So, all right, so, so take it from us. <laughs> if you are ever intimidated by a stamp set, because mm-hmm. here's one set that both of us were intimidated right? by. Just do it because now we and both you are. I think we would know what we're doing yeah. now, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, okay. so. Our, that's our dirty so, little here, secret. Feel better. Dirty little secret out. Yeah. There <laughs> we've been outed. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, loving the set. Absolutely love. Where do you yeah. see these? So samples. much fun stuff to do with it. Yeah. We and we. I, I gave a little sneak peek um, on the dem, our Stamp It demonstrator oh, yeah. group on Sunday. Some of the stuff I had been working with, including a, a project that was in progress, which I almost <laughs> never do. Usually, I wait until I'm finished. But I said, you know what? Let's reach reach the stamper. She's really got me inspired oh. to kind of step outside that little comfort zone and just <laughs> just you know go with it. So I showed an unfinished project. So for those of you in the Stamp It group that are watching, you'll actually get to see the finished project and more. It's really cool. And more because Linda has some. I awesome did some too. Projects with yeah. it too. So these are wow projects. And and we're gonna make two cards today. We're yeah. both making we're a both card. Stamping this it is today. like a first. I know, right? This is gonna be. We are totally. Go, we are totally just stepping this up. Yeah. So yes, we're very happy to be back too. Thank you for uh, oh. the day there. My my computer, which I need in order to to do this. <laughs> All of a sudden, to Monday night, just went, and I was like, oh my gosh, what do I do? Murphy's Law yeah. hangs oh. low on us, and some Thank days just... Goodness for the Apple Store. Oh, that's all <laughs> I have to say. I walk in, and I'm like, it's broken. Yeah. Make it work, please. <laughs> and he's like, oh, you just need to do blah, 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 yeah. blah, blah, blah. And of yeah. course, it, 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 it did require reinstalling the operating system, which meant what I had on it was gone, but fortunately, it's not my main computer, so I did... It did take a little while to get things reset back up, but it wasn't the end of the world. So but we're here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we have, um, so let's talk about the giveaways. You want to, want to hear about the giveaways? Who there's doesn't want to hear about giveaways, right? I just have to say, there's someone watching us from Dubai. <gasps> Stop it, Dubai. Hi. I love Dubai. Amanda from oh. Dubai. Oh, like, I, was, I just, I'm sorry. I just feel exotic. I that know. We're I was just there last she was, summer. Yes. <gasps> Oh, I loved it. I cannot wait. Someday, it's on my bucket list to go back there someday because I I was dying yeah. to go skydiving over the palm oh in gosh. Dubai. That has always been on my bucket list, and it didn't work out on this trip. So I, I, hopefully, Amanda from Dubai, I hope to go there again someday. <laughs> we'll see. So it looks like in my, my resetting things up, our names are, are backwards here. So if you want to call me Linda, I'm okay with that. <laughs> we'll figure it all out later. Tina, Amy. We're just happy to be back. Sandy says we're double trouble. Yeah, yes, yeah. we are. We are yes. yes we are all right let's look at what we're oh, giving away please. today for prize patrol where are we all right so where am i all right prize okay, so commentary. Where are we at? live prizes live. on live. the right so here we go so this is one of the hundred dollar yeah, um, celebration set. set it's a big set it's and this is uber big because it's the it's wood, wood block. mount yes so wood block. this is the happy wishes so this is one of the live sets so you get both of those then we have the this is two different um 
things. Two different in celebrations, the celebration. and that's one to level two and one to level one. And so they go together. So yeah. this is the Amazing You stamp set and the Celebrate You thinlets. These are the amazing thinlets that are in the uh, uh, celebrations this year. The you now can't get it. Uh, right now, this was an unclaimed prize. The, uh, the Mary Patterns was an unclaimed prize from the well, Witcher. There we go. <laughs> So this is Mary Pat's is up. And okay, this. now I am giving away um, these metal rimmed pearls with the other three. Okay, so all so three of the lives get metal rimmed pearls. The reason being is because I was doing an incentive yeah. um, for the mil the two million dollar yeah. celebration, and you I was giving away extra. pearls. <laughs> I accidentally ordered the wrong ones. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> so I have a lot of these metal rimmed pearls. You're getting a lot. So of you guys are getting lately. a bonus because you, of my get, metal you, you, get, you get, get metal pearls. You get metal pearls. You get metal pearls. Who doesn't want metal pearls? Metal pearls rock. <laughs> And then, all right, so, and then, this, eh? Oh, a lie? What's this? Of course, of, of, apparently, we're always on, behind the wrong names. Oh. We're always on the wrong side. <laughs> yes. That's awesome. Hi, I'm Tammy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes, excellent. <laughs> Uh, that's all right. It's all all good. right. And then, all right. So then, so, so that's if you leave a comment during today's broadcast. If you do not win during today's broadcast, but you leave a comment, and if you're watching later, and you leave a comment, but then you leave a comment and you add, the, you share it on Facebook, and you say the word shared with the D in your comments. In the comments on our next broadcast, which is in two weeks. What day is that? March. Uh, uh, oh, I have it. Hold on, hold on. Here it is. Here it is. March 13th. We will March be back 13th. on March 13th. You can win the perennial birthday stamp set and the matching oh oh, hold kit Hold on, hold on, box. hold on. We're not on you. Here we go. Oh, there we're we go. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I had to switch so I can see the date. The perennial birthday stamp set and the matching kit. So this is a package. And that's a whole kit. It's it's sealed. We don't want it's to open sealed. it so you yes, guys can no, get the yeah, brand yeah, yeah, yeah. So we so, are going to give that one away live on our next episode. On the 13th. Um, so everybody who leaves a comment on my channel or on Linda's channel or on YouTube or on Facebook, it doesn't matter. They will all be put together. Um, you are all entered. So if you are watching live on mine or Linda's Facebook channel, because we're going to be live on yes. Facebook currently, um, you will be entered uh, to win. We will be drawing the winner of the live prizes. Okay, let's switch. Here we go. Is that better? That's no. better. No, okay. <laughs> I feel weird, though. I feel like I'm on the wrong side. <laughs> Hold on. We have, we have notes, <laughs> and we <laughs> screw it up. Notes, oh, and I'm, we still I'm, have it backwards. Yeah. So, I'm just going to change the... Oh, my yeah. gosh. Too funny. So, anyways, if you um, leave a comment while we're live on <laughs> Facebook, because we, uh, currently we only have the capability of being live at one at, that's at, uh, at a time, and and we Facebook, crashed the computer with that. So, yeah, you know, and we still have a hard time with that. So we're, yeah. we're, we're working on it, but we, <laughs> for now it's just Facebook. If you are live on Facebook right now, you are leaving a comment. You are entered yeah. to win one of the live prizes. If you didn't win one of the live prizes or you are watching the replay on Facebook or YouTube on either channel, you will be entered into the after live drawing. Yeah. So yeah. everybody has a yeah. chance to and win. And if you are watching this on a replay on our blogs, because you can watch on our right, blog. Right, right, right. Leaving a comment on the blog doesn't yeah, work. We don't, pull, gotta... we don't pull from the blog. It has Go to, to be on, on YouTube or Facebook yeah. in order for it to be yeah. entered. I love the comments. But we love blog. the comments on that. I'm not going <laughs> to say don't comment. <laughs> but that's not where they get pulled from. So, so and if you type the word shared, we'll enter you a second D. time. Yes. So with a D. And speaking of that, um, our last episode, we featured the Stampin' Up! Bubbled Over. A bubbling over bundle. I love that song. And we have um, the bubble over bundle from that episode. This is the after live replay drawing for all of you who either didn't win live or who left a comment on the after live video on YouTube or Facebook have been entered into this drawing and we are going to give it away right now. So we're going to go to where are you? Everything's new here. <laughs> there we go. All right, so um, we are going to use random.org for that. I'm going to scroll through here really fast, so you're going to really have to. Yeah. <laughs> if you see if you see your name or somebody else's name in here twice, it means they shared, and they type shared in the comments, and we love you, and so we're giving you a bonus little shot at winning this, <laughs> this bundle. Okay, so are you ready? Whoever's name is on top is our winner of the um, prize, and that and will be... Is. Diana McNally McCall. Diana Yay! McCall, congratulations. She's a lucky girl. She is. She's oh, a very she lucky prior girl. winner? I think she won something recently. Oh. Yeah, she did. Go, Diana. Congrats. Yeah, nice. All right, so those are our giveaways. And now let's talk a little bit about what's yes. happening um, on sale. I'm done. <laughs> 
new setup. We have a new setup. Hi. We have new screens. <laughs> All right. So she's like, one of us Your is going to have to. I'm, head, off, right? I, I'm too tall. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. All right. So we, we talked about how we're, only one of us could do this. And so, of course, we both stepped out. We didn't tell about who was going to do it. So we can try to both do it if I squeeze in. There we go. There we go. Okay. okay. Paper pumpkin. <laughs> During celebration, paper pumpkin, if you order a uh, prepaid subscription for three months, six months, or 12 months, you will also earn free celebration sets. But that's not it. But that's During not the month of March. March is the fifth anniversary for Paper Pumpkin. And there's going to be a special gift in the Paper Pumpkin box. So you want to make sure you get your order in for Paper Pumpkin before March 10th. The 10th of the month is the key date for Paper Pumpkin. If you do not have your order into Paper Pumpkin by that date, you will not get it. You want marches. Yes, you want the free sure. stuff. You want the free and gifts. you want the celebration. Yeah. It's double even if you're the free. Already, even if you already subscribe yes. to Paper Pumpkin, you can order. You can do one of these three, six, or yes. 12 months during celebration and get that bonus gift. And then when you put the, it gives you a yes. code when you put the code in yes. to your, it adds on. your account, it just automatically goes in there and says, yes. boom, you're covered yes. for the next three months yes. and you just got a yes. free stamp. So if you, when you do the so three month, six month, or 12 month subscription, you will do that through a Stampin' Up order. You can do it through your workshop, through a online order you will get a code in the email you then need to take that code and put it into mypaperpumpkin.com if you do not put it in before the 10th you will not get this one so it's a two-step process but it is so worth it you get your celebration you get oh, your free yeah. paper pumpkin you get your paper pumpkin and, and then you, you get, get your paper, free I know. it's like extra a triple, triple dipping triple bonus there all right <laughs> next up <laughs> We'll get this. We'll get it. Just like everything, we gotta learn it all at some point, right? Yeah. We wouldn't be here if we didn't no. jump out and try. Forty-nine stuff. episodes. Forty-nine. I know. That means next episode oh, is God. number fifty. Oh my God! Can you believe it? All that? right, we gotta plan big. I know. We'll have to have a fiftieth birthday <laughs> party, I think, for the next episode. Oh, Definitely, March thirteenth is gonna be a party day. <laughs> so, uh, celebration is still going on, but March is the last month of it, which means mm -hmm. several things. One, at the end of March 30th will be the last time you'll be able to get any of these items, except the, the, the folder and the die set. But you can't are, get them until the catalog and, comes and out. They'll be available for purchase in the new catalog, but not until um, So May, you won't get June? them in April, May. Yeah. April, May. But who wants to pay for them when you can get them free, right? right? You won't get them free. So and, and everything else in that catalog will be gone forever. So Bye. now's the time to earn it. You can get Celebration products three ways. You can place it $50 order in one of our online stores and you automatically get a free celebration set. You can join Stampin' Up! and you get two free catalog sets. And now these are catalog sets, so they can be any amount. They can be the big $40 sets. You can get any any catalog set you want in addition to your demonstrator kit. So it's, you get... Yeah. Win, um, win, win. Yeah, it's such a win. It's such a win. You get $125 worth of products. You only pay $99 and you get free shipping. This is U.S. totals. Yeah. And you get... And on top of that, two free catalog stamp yes. sets. Make My your gosh. wish list. Take the two right? most expensive stamp sets wow. out. Wow. Best then deal pick. ever. Best deal ever. And yeah. I mean, our stamp at demonstrator group has just exploded Bro, during celebration. It's, it's huge. You don't even have to do this for. You can just do it for the fun and for the discount. You don't have to do it for any other. It's but like we want to join we're like it. Costco <laughs> or BJ's. Exactly. It's like a shopping club. Yeah, but you get a discount. You get a discount. It's so you, for your hundred dollar entrance fee, which mm -hmm. you just get to walk in the door at BJ's or Sam's, you get all this product mm -hmm. and shopping at a discount. I'm half in. Okay. Right? <laughs> <laughs> We're having fun with this new setup. <laughs> and the third way is with stamp and rewards. So that's if you either have a large order, um, any order over 150 gets you stamp and rewards, which are free products with Stampin' Up. If it's over 250, you get bonus celebration um, products. So that it's just bonus, bonus. Now, bonus. it does not have to be a single order. It could be a, a workshop order. It could be a book. Sh if you combine it with friends, some, we used to call that a book show, but now I think it's just oh call God, it combined it with friends. <laughs> <laughs> combined with friends. It's not yeah. words with friends. It's stamping with friends. <laughs> That's uh, any of that, it gets you, get you bonus stamping rewards. And if you're a demonstrator, you get stamping rewards and a discount and celebration products. So you get everything. Win, win, win. Totally worth it. You can take advantage of all three. Okay. So, and you get to play with us. Exactly. We're the best, right? Right? Okay. They're like, yeah, okay. Yeah. I know. Sure. <laughs> All right. So that is what's happening in Stamp World. Come on. I don't know. I was going to say it may switch. It may not. There we go. We're, we're, in our, okay, we're in our spots now. We're in our correct. I'm under my own name. 
All right, so apparently we haven't been like that for a while. We're going to no. have to get used to either standing <laughs> on the side or we're going to have to fix that. <laughs> All right, are you guys ready for some stamping? Let's play. Let's play Let's with the play. waterfront stamp set. Yeah. Good times. All right, so coming Someone, down. Oh, well, I forgot. Someone asked if we knew what was going to be in the March set. We don't have that clip. Um, but. Oh, sometimes, the, the March, yeah, the pumpkin? March paper pumpkin. But sometimes Stampin' Up will give little hints. But they you need sometimes. to make sure you are following them on Facebook. So you can find Paper Pumpkin on Facebook and you follow them, and every once in a while they'll throw up like a picture or yeah, a color. Give you a little little. So you get little teases. So if you ever want to have a clue, because that's where I get a clue if I do get one. From Facebook. <laughs> I, I mean, just don't who have else? A clue. Um, go go <laughs> there. So that is my advice on any clues on Facebook. So. Or All right, so <laughs> we are going down to our stamping table. We'll move all <laughs> these goodies out of the way. Leave a leave a comment. You'll be entered into all of this. Okay, don't forget, everybody gets metal rim pearls when they win today. <laughs> everybody gets metal uh, rim pearls. People are watching at work, so just oh, turn the volume they got down. The volume down. You turn know what? I, and I, you guys are gonna laugh at me because Flash was down here while we were setting up, so I brought him his little treat so he, you know, so he could do a little, and he went, I'm out do here. a little cameo, and then he took off, so yeah. no Flash today, boring. but Flash is doing awesome. Yeah, I know a lot of you have been asking, other than his fur isn't growing back where they shaved him. <laughs> <laughs> but he doesn't seem to mind it, so we're okay with it. So this is the Waterfront stamp set. It's a beautiful set. This is actually like a builder stamp set. Um, I, I don't know if it's considered a two-step stamp set, but it really, it's a multi-step. These pieces are really made to kind of build on each other and go together. And, uh, oh, Deborah says she has to apologize because she thinks she accidentally hit the mad emoticon. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. We never get upset about no. the mad emoticon. You see it every once in a while and you're like, what? A lot of times, yeah, a lot of times that's what happens. Somebody hits it by accident, yeah. and then it goes flying across the screen, and I just think somebody's like all embarrassed. <laughs> that's what I thought it was—the embarrassment icon. I didn't know. I was like, oh, okay, okay. Anyway, so this is—it's just such a great, great set. Now, it, like I said, I was intimidated by it at first. Yeah. I really wasn't sure what. I, I just was afraid to open it. So I'm glad that you guys. <laughs> I'm glad that you guys really called this one out yeah. when I did the poll last week. And, and mentioned it because now that I've used it, I freaking love it. I think this is going to become one it, of my favorites. It, favorite it was a lot of fun to play with. It's awesome. So we have some cards to share with you guys. And you'll see how kind of limitless it can yeah. be. I mean, there's just, it, I want to say this may be one of the most versatile stamp sets I've yes. ever played yes. with because yes. it, there's so many things you can do with it. So I'm going to let Linda kick Ooh. off the cards. Okay. <clears throat> so these are a few that I made. Um, so this is the first one where I'm trying to see where I am. So here is, this is it at its simplest and it's basic in that I just took the stamps, stamped them in ink and put them down onto whisper white. So it's really just very basic. Um, and just set up a little mountain scene. Uh, the fun thing is when you do take some of these and you just stamp like over them and move them, some, you know, stamped yeah, off, stamped yeah, yeah. on, you have a, um, you have depth, you know, it really, it really adds a lot of that easily i see tina just makes an artist out of all of us that it is, is so, so true. true that is a perfect statement tina even Thank when you're not you. an artist yeah. like me so then um this one and i case this from somebody i saw out there um it was trying to make the trees into like flowers and oh, i how cute i stamped this on um shimmery white i don't know if you can probably can't see the shimmer um so that I could watercolor it a little more. So I stamped this with the um, top of the trees in uh, Mellow Mambo and the bottom. I just kind of stamped the top then turned it around, stamped to the bottom on um, Artichoke and then stamped it down. And then I just used my Aqua Painter that and kind of awesome. blended it all in just to kind of you know, make it look a little different. Gorgeous. So that's another... And Linda and I will both have these samples on our blogs, on the resource page to the yes. Stampin' Scoop show. It usually takes us about an hour after the live it has ended to get them up. Yeah. So you don't need to take screenshots. Yes, there you go. <laughs> we'll have them up for you. So then this I wanted to show off how a monotone. I love You can really that. make it look very depthful. And um, so is depth full a word? I, I'm making We're it a word. Add that to the, 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 the the dictionary is a fluid document. Yes, it so is. So I, I have our own. We I'm have adding own. depth full <laughs> to <laughs> the. Um, that's depth, my suggestion. Depth full is our new word. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, so this is just a combination of using our Whisper White uh, craft ink, the Knight of Navy ink, and I did heat emboss the moon so it stood out even more. It's striking. And then I used the um, a chalk pen. 
to add a little more glimmer on uh, the, the lake. So this is really cool. I will tell you, um, just so I try if you can see, I added, I tried to add little trees, but depth wise, if I had stamped the entire tree, it was going to look funny. So because these are, oh, we're not on here. I'm I, this. I'm not using the tree because the tree's not on a block. Um, <laughs> it is on a block. It's just it's, hiding it's, on she's the other side of the it, table. I don't want to screw her up. So let's say this was the tree. I actually just stamped it like this. I squeezed it in my hand, inked it, oh, and only stamped like the top you. so that I only got the little bit of the tippy tops oh. of the tree. Um, just so you could kind of imagine there was trees. And I didn't get this full tree that didn't look proportional. So there's, there's you're my getting, little you're tip. You're getting lots of hearts on the blue card. I did tell Tammy I did not card. want to remake this card live because I knew I would screw it up. I'm like, please don't pick the blue one. <laughs> so I'm going to let Tammy show the other ones because those are the ones she uh Okay, so the first mind. one is from Veronica. Veronica Salas because, you know, she is just a... Uh, she was on top of this step right... This stamp set right away. It's one of the first ones she played with. She came up with this card, and I, I mean, of course, I love the card. All over, you know, I know, like, and we're like afraid of no, it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and this one's just a beautiful one. She's got the the pinewood plank um, folder in the background, and just a, just a simple, easy um, card there. I like the pinewood plank. Yeah, it really does add to it, and this one also has that same pinewood plank um, folder. Yeah, and just a minute, just a touch. There we yeah. go. There we go. I'll give you a little bit of a closer look at this one. Now this one uses the layering ovals. It looks like it's like a a a hole cut out of you know a fence or a, a, you know a, a a piece of plywood. And you're looking off into the or a tree even. You're looking off into the distance here at this little cabin in the woods. It's so <laughs> like cool. all the cabin in the woods. <laughs> and then it's got the sun. It's using some of these pieces to make the suns in the background. And it's just, just beautiful. And Trisha is saying the water front stamp set, the water from the high tide stamp set works well. So I'm glad that you mentioned that, Trisha. Hold that thought. <laughs> <laughs> Put a pin in that because we're going to come back to it. <laughs> All right. So this is a man card to me, this one. Um, yes. And of course, it doesn't have to be a man card, but it's it, it uses the, the, the gentleman suite. That's in the occasion catalog, that ribbon that's so yummy, and the paper, and it just pulls it together. But it's a couple simple stamps here. We just got a mountains and some trees in the sun, and the words. Just a simple stamp, but wow. Yeah. Well, it's so, so great. Now, these next cards, um, this one is wow. This idea yeah. I got from... <clears throat> um, Michelle Zindorf, so, actually, right, she was my start inspiration on this July one. Cards. Right, I know. Right I should have saved it. As soon as I yeah. did it, I was like, wow, this is awesome. And I, she was my inspiration. She had created a, a similar card, although I think she did it a little differently. <laughs> and, um, and she had made it for her brother-in-law, who was in the service. And just as a, a military thank you card idea, you know, because like, a lot of people do cards for troops. And, yeah. and, and they, oh, that'd be they great for the troops. They love these ideas for that. <clears throat> and so when I put it together, it's just like, Wow, that is just awesome. I love it so much. This card I will be doing live on Friday. Ooh. So just a little uh, a little uh, advertisement for what's coming up. I don't know what I'm um, doing. At, and I'm going to do a set on Friday. So this card, I will be making both of these live oh, on Friday oh my on my online class on Friday. And this one here is another one. Um, this is the, <laughs> Trisha had mentioned, the high tide stamp set with the water in it. This one actually uses the high tide stamp set for the water and the birds. Um, a little bit. Oh of, yeah, there you go. A little bit. It's just yep. very subtle. And I'll show you how I did that on Friday when I do my live. And then we've got some copper because I love copper. Yeah, I love that. Amazing. Love There's that it. die from Celebration. Yep. And this is the die. In fact, I'm giving this die. We're, yeah. giving, we're giving this die yeah. away today. Make sure you leave a comment. You Make might sure win. you leave a comment because you could win it live. All right. Now next week I will do this one. I'm going to actually do a few more with this technique. This was an accidental technique. I'm going to call it. I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> Brush metal, brush copper. I'm not quite sure what I'm calling it yet. Brush metal. It was completely yeah. by accident, but um, I will do this one next week live um, because we only had so much time, so we had to narrow down what we were going to do live today. And I had so much fun with it. I'm like, I want to make this one. No, I want to make this one. No, I want to make. So, anyways, long story short, I will be making all three of these two on Friday, probably this one on Tuesday, and I'll probably do a few more with this fun technique because it's easy and quick. So, be looking for those um, in my upcoming online classes. Cool. And you want to go first? You want me to go one. first? All right. Yeah, we should make you guys vote. You Any, want, mini, you want Linda no. to go? You want Linda? Okay, I'll go first. I'm, I was just saying, I'll take too long. I'm here. Delay. So <laughs> here is the card that won for today's 
um, Stampin' Scoop <laughs> show <laughs> <the ones laughs> out of all the ones that I made. This is the one we decided to go live. I, you know what? I just think it pops. Like, wow! I love it. I know. I had Linda vote on mine, though, then I went and voted on hers. Yeah. I absolutely love it. I love it. And this one, I want to give a shout out to uh, Tanya Boser. Yeah, um, this this was inspired by a card she made. And so easy oh. to do. And just another one that's just awesome. Like, I want to be on that beach with that sunset with a margarita right, right? right now. <laughs> awesome. Just awesome. So, uh, back up just a little bit. And um, in the interest of Facebook Live, uh, <laughs> through the magic of Facebook Live, I pre-cut my um, stitch shapes. And there it is. I've got, this is the smallest circle and the second largest oval. And if you can read my handwriting, I wrote it down for you. Uh, from the stitch shapes, which mine is a complete mess because my magnets don't seem to be holding as awesomely as I think they should be. <laughs> I put them I put them in these. I took them out of their original casing. I almost think their original casing might have been better. <laughs> I, I, I have problems with those with, I know. large sets. Okay, the magnet. The magnet seemed like a good idea at the time, yeah. but it's just not working for we the set. We need the magnets, the strength of what's on the stamper. But this set is a, a staple. If you're a stamper, this this yes. set is a staple. It's a must-have. It's yes. the stitch shape size. I use it on almost every. So day. I used a circle, and I know, and because they, it's got all the different shapes in yeah. it, and it's got the little stitching around it, which is awesome. So the smallest circle and the second largest oval on this one. And um, what I'm going to do first is probably do some stamping. So I'll just pull my little. My little cart out here on my little <laughs> stamps. The colors here are Soft Suede, Real Red, Pumpkin Pie, and Daffodil Delight. And I will have a, a PDF on the resource page after the show um, with these with the, this information on it, the, the colors I'm using and the, the products that I'm using. And just a note, Linda and I discussed this. And we decided, <laughs> since we're making two cards today, I'm going to make a card and she's going to make a card. We each have a resource page after that's linked in the video of this blog, so you can click on it to get to the resources. But it takes us about an hour to get yeah. to get them up. Just a heads up on that. Um, we decided I'm going to put the PDF for my card on my my blog, and she's going to put the PDF for her card on her blog, and we'll link. Yeah, there'll we'll be a link, link to both of them. But um, you got to go to both blogs. Now, <laughs> is what we're saying. I'm making you work for it. <laughs> it's free, but we're making yeah. you work we for it. We just also the, <laughs> it, it, the blog post would just be way too long with. It both info of both cards. Yeah, so we yeah, want yeah. to give you all the info. So just go to both. She works hard for her money. <laughs> so hard, Flash honey, dance. honey. Okay. So we've got this. I'm just going to turn that over because there was a smudge on the front. So I'm taking the um, the <laughs> stitch shapes. And this is very vanilla cardstock. And I'm Daffodil Delight ink is what I'm going to be using here. And a sponge dauber. And I'm a lefty, so it's my left my left index finger that you're getting here. And I'm just going to rub this over the entire panel. Uh, Nancy, the dies, um, the stamp cases that Tammy has her dies in are the clear uh, cases. And I think, do you have it on your... These are actually clear mount cases. You can buy empty cases in our online store for the clear mount stamp sets. And that's what it is in the magnet I just got. It's an adhesive right. magnet sheet right. I got at Amazon. Right. They're not, they, Stampin' Up! messed up. It's not in the catalog, but it is available. It is in the online store. So if you go if you, to Tammy or my online stores, you can I think it's under, search it. it. I think under tools. It's called yeah. Um, yeah. cases. They're, they are there. A package of cases. You yeah. can get the wood mount and the clear mount, and then you can get and the half And then the half size, size wood. Which I put my um, die brush in, which is Oh, awesome. you put that in the full one. I put that in the full one? Yeah. You tell everyone the half, and I'm like, no, you don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. I, it's, no, a you don't. it's a half-sized one. It's a half-sized wood mount. No, it's a full wood mount. Oh. <laughs> wow. All this time I've been giving you bad information. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm like, every time I hear you say that, oh I go, no, gosh. you don't. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Because mine's in a full. I'm like, yours does not fit in a half. I know it doesn't. Oh. Okay. Well, there you go. I, I don't even know what I'm doing half the time. And that is the truth. In case you were wondering, that is the truth. I don't know what I'm doing half the time. I am, I'm, but I want to tell you what I'm doing right now. And that is, I've got a sponge dauber in the pumpkin pie ink pad, and I'm rubbing it along the the top, probably half, maybe a little less than a half of that oval, and then just a touch. I'm, I, I switch sponge dauber, daubers in between colors. Just a little touch on the top edge. I think that's what makes it pop is that yeah, little bit of red. It's tiny little, you don't want to overdo the red. It's got to be just a teeny tiny little bit of it, bright, real red on the top. 
And oh, that see? is what gives you your sunset, right? Yeah. Told you, know, you I want to be on that beach. I know. I know, especially right now yeah, in February. I'm even going to take a little bit of um, Daffodil Delight and blend that just a hair. Blend that down there. So that's our, our, our beach, right? Ugh, nice. Love it. Loving it. All right. So now it's time for some stamping. So this is the long piece, and I'm going to show you the piece here that I'm using. It's this one. On, and um, this is a photopolymer set, set, which thank God for that because you kind of need to be able to see through it. I'm going to take this down towards the bottom edge. This is going to be kind of like our little sandy knoll. People are noticing your fortune cookie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I, the very first time I opened that fortunate to know you stamp set, yeah. um, it, that, that uh, daffodil ink pad was not so fortunate to meet it. <laughs> Oh, here hold on, our... hold on. I have to take a little break here. <laughs> so he decided to come. He decided to come back for a little. For those of you, I don't, I'm not sure, especially if you're new. This is Flash. He's our little mascot, Flash Gordon the Beagle, and he was diagnosed See? last month with cancer, which was that was rough. Yeah. It was very rough for us. Um, but the doctor put him on a, a chemo treatment, and they called this week, and they said that he is. Oh, yeah. Hi. His cancer is in remission. <laughs> Yay! So that is awesome. What isn't awesome is that his fur is not growing back. He's patchy. He shaved him. Yeah, we're calling him Patchwork Puppy. But he doesn't seem to mind that so much. But he's feeling Just awesome. Just giving him treats. He's doing mm -hmm. awesome. Yeah, he's like, where's my treat, Mom? <laughs> where's my treat? I came down. <laughs> So yeah, a lot of times at our all classes, you hear Flash snoring in the background, yeah. but that is a fantastic update for the patchwork <laughs> puppy. Uh, this is the waterfront stamp set that we're and now, playing and with. And now back to our regularly oh, scheduled yeah. stamping. There you go, Flash. <laughs> had, to, had a little Flash cameo. So, now he's oh, not going to leave. <laughs> did we go back down here? Come on. There we go. All right. So um, where, where we last left off, we just stamped our sandy bottom <laughs> with our, our little piece at the waterfront. Now we're going to build our beach scene. The rest of this we're going to do with some basic black. So I'm just going to move the rest of these out of the way. And we're going to start with, yes, fortunate to know you. Not so fortunate <laughs> for my daffodil and pad. But you know what? I just wiped it down with a paper That's towel, right. re-inked it with a re-inker. Make sure you get those re-inkers. They're very important. And my pad will forever be tattooed. And it does make a really good conversation <laughs> piece, but it doesn't harm anything. It really isn't it's so bad. It's kind of funny, actually. Okay, so we've got the little cabin in the woods, but now it's going to be a little lifeguard shack on the beach. There you go. Someone thought it looked like an outhouse. I saw a comic go by. It could be an outhouse. My gosh, wheels are spinning. It totally <laughs> could be an outhouse. We could go. Oh, baby, the places we could go with this. Oh. See, <laughs> now you need, this is why you need the labeling alphabet set that you can build words. Right. You know, Now we've got the, the stems to the palm trees, which could be, oh, so many things as well. These could be antenna for bugs or whatever. <laughs> and we've got the palm tree tops, which also could be eyebrows or, you know, interesting hairdos. Oh. Who knows? <laughs> so many things we can do with this set. Oh my god. We should have challenged so ourselves I'm then to do some crazy building our little scene things. here. Um, now, one thing I want to point out, the, um, let's see if I can hold that right up there. So when I stamped the, the, the trunk of the, the palm tree there, and I don't know if I'm going to even zoom you in just a little bit so you can see, I don't love um, that you can kind of see a little bit through it. So if this ever happens to you, if you are stamping a solid image, especially in the black, but oh, you can do it in any color, I'm going to show you a, a quick little tip. And that is with the black stamp and write marker, you can just go in here and color that in. And that fixes all of the imperfections when you're trying to do a silhouette. And cool. that really may be a little bit on the so Earth Nikki cabin. thinks the, the top of the palm trees look like pom poms. Pom -poms. I'm thinking fireworks. I think everyone Ooh, fireworks. now start thinking of ideas. So now that would be great I on your know, red, white, and blue card. Right? <laughs> fireworks! Oh my gosh! Yeah, we might have to in here. There we go. Card. Who knows where that See, card's going to go? See, this is where how inspiration goes. Okay, One thing really after another. Get, this is where we get the inspiration. This will be our favorite stamp set by the end. Oh my gosh! It's already climbing it, up there it's very moving quickly. Up, yes. From I don't want to touch it to... I know, too. I'm kind of afraid to... like, to... let's do this one. I'm like, no, I don't want to. I know. I'm like, I'm moving from I'm kind of afraid to I freaking love this set. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right. So now all I have left is assembly. So I'm just going to take some snail adhesive, which is a double-sided um, tape. And again, all of these measurements will be on the free PDF that will be available on my blog yeah. following this. And if you are on Linda's blog, um, there will be a link. 
this. to it as well. So yes. you'll be able to get it on both. And um, then I'm going to take some Stampin' Dimensionals and pop that up. <laughs> Everyone likes the fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, got the wheel spinning. I love it when you can use sets for more than one. Yeah, you know, they have. Yeah. They're versatile like this, but I, right. I just didn't realize just how versatile this set was right. until we really started playing with it. I always thought when people tell me they're um, a little smudge on that side too, so I guess in a gonna... funk and they can't quite think about what to do, or they have no, you know, feeling creative. I'm like, just copy, pick something, copy it, because I think the actual act of putting ink I on agree. paper I agree. sparks and the And then creativity. when you start doing it, a lot of times you'll, you know, a lot of times you go outside the box and start getting your own yeah. ideas as you're playing but yes. sometimes i just love something so much i yeah so i always tell I, people just when i just, case i just i fall in love with something and i just don't yeah. want copy something. Do <laughs> i feel something. like it's perfect get the ink on the paper and oh, I'm it'll, it'll start that all over the place well we won't look okay thank you thank you i should not have put that upside down on I, top I, of yeah you gotta let it dry else. sometimes yeah Especially when you're what building else? up so much ink. You know what? If you're the one that, that wins one of these prizes, I'm going to send this to you. You'll just know why. You know, <laughs> the smudge of love. Smudge of love. All right. So now those are little dimensionals on there. We're going to pop this up. On top there. Oh, people want it centered in the camera. Oh, That'd my goodness. You OCD people. You want to see it? <laughs> what? I know. Come that, on. I'm you want everything. I do this. <laughs> in focus. So... Anyway, well, I wasn't doing anything down below, so, <laughs> oh well. Dimensional adding. <laughs> okay, so now I've got perfect white accents, which are also really awesome to color with the new Stampin' Blend alcohol markers. If you would so um, like different colored perfect accents. And they accents. look so yeah, they do. yummy. But on this particular card, they actually blend really well with the very vanilla, so they become perfect very vanilla yeah. accents. And that is how quick and easy this card was. Just again, um, it was Tonya Bozer was the originally my original inspiration for that one. Beautiful, beautiful idea there. So um, that is my card share, and now I'm Next. going to turn the reins <laughs> over to Linda. Okay. Well, we decided we were, you know, it's end of Tag, February. You're right. Tag, you're <laughs> right. um, Because it's the end of February here, and we are um, craving like summer that we were going to stick on beach theme. So I know uh, I kind of like the beach theme. That's fun. I am doing a beach theme card as well. So did you show all your card off? Yes, you did. So I'll show my card off. So this is, I have more of the aqua blue. So I Tammy's is it. the sunset, you know, for the yeah, evening cocktail. High noon. Mine is the, you know, lounging on the floaty in the lagoon card. <laughs> so Let's see. So I'm going to, let's stick that over here for a minute and dig up my paper. Ah. To do this card, I am using a uh, watercolor paper because I want to um, blend the inks after I stamp them. So we're going to start and I have tons of inks. <laughs> I have so many Good inks. Time. I'm going to, let's see, hold on. Get up. There we go. Lots and lots of different colors here. So I, because I'm going to use uh, some scrap paper too, because I don't want to get it on. Oop, there we go. Anywhere. Um, so let's start. So I am going to start. I'm trying to remember where I started. Um, let's see. So first, I am using this long kind of straight stamp set, and I'm going to stamp that in crumb cake in the middle. Um, as a place to um, put my beach. All right, let's see. Stamp set again. Here, we go. Here is, this is the waterfront stamp set. It's in the Occasions catalog. This is the stamp set we are featuring today. All right, so I'm going to start. I'm building up my beach. <laughs> Mary. So Mary wonders if there was any color I didn't use, and I will tell you between um, doing... Wisteria Wonder, I don't see any Wisteria Wonder <laughs> yeah. on that card. Doing all these <laughs> cards over the past couple days, I've had almost every color all over my desk. To the point is, every once in a while, I just had to stop and put them all back. My OCD was going a little bananas. Um, all right, so... This is the Waterfront stamp set. So, all right, so that's my beach. That is. Oh, can we get some more of those? You know what? Well, I'm going to. 
Can you type we're gonna it we're on? gonna um, take a commercial break here. <laughs> we got a few questions because people are popping on later. Uh -huh. I'm gonna pop on over to um, whoops, there it is. This is the featured product that we're using there today. It is a waterfront stamp set. You'll find it in the occasions catalog. Just want to give our little um, <laughs> <laughs> official broadcasting statement there yep. for anybody that came in late. Um, everything that we're doing today is featuring this stamp set beautiful stamp sets so leave a gonna... comment to win a prize <laughs> uh, leave a comment to win a prize <laughs> all right back to our regularly scheduled stamping program already in progress yes. <laughs> i don't want any of the people who popped on to realize that you know just sit right. silently and not realize that they could win something all right so next i'm going to do the mountain and that is the stamp the image that i'm going to use and i'm doing that in old olive because i'm thinking like hawaii where the mountains are really green and I ink that up. Let's see. Can you see me? Can you see me now? Yeah. Oh, no, you're great. There you're great. we go. All right. So we're going to stick that right here on top. Here we go. Actually, let's see if I can. I want, I want more ink. Here we go. I'm going to try and uh, stamp exactly over it again. But it doesn't matter if I don't get it exact, but I'm going to try. I'm a little off. All right. There we go. Then... I'm going to work on, let's see. Right, I can hear that dog sniffing yeah, around over here. Yeah, she's way in the back around the corner. Um, right. So I'm going to do my palm tree base in chocolate chip. He's looking at me like, why, you got a treat for me? I know, yeah. I'll come out of there. <laughs> my plan What are you going to give me for it? All right. So there's my, my palm tree base. Out of chocolate chip. Good boy. Now my palm tree leaves, prongs. Hold on, I gotta find those. There we go. They are also going to be in uh, old olive. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Thank you, Sandy and Jean. Jean says we all want to thank you for doing these demos oh. for us. We need vision. That's very sweet. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Speaking of Hawaii, you have Denny on here. Aloha from Maui. Aloha. <laughs> Okay. This so, one's for you, Denny. Here's my son, and I wanted to do, to give it some real depth, I'm doing a rock and roll technique. So if you, this is kind of an old-fashioned stamping technique, but if you're new, it's fun. So I'm taking my son, and I'm going to ink it up really good in crushed curry, and I'm coming over here to tan, uh, tangerine tango. <laughs> Which one is it? Which orange? <laughs> and um, I'm going to just roll around the edge. Don't step backwards. Oh, Flash, you're right behind me, huh? <laughs> he's thinking he's going to get another tree. Ah. He's giving me the face. So, cute little bumpy dog. See face. how that makes the sun kind of pop. All right. Close this up. Oops, oh, here you are, right behind me. <laughs> and now, where's my water? All right, so now I'm going to use this larger kind of blob. I'm going to use it this way. And I do water. So many things you can do with that stamp. Yep. And I'm making sure. I keep looking up because I want to make sure I'm in here. Well, now that I've reduced the number of inks that I'm, <laughs> I'm using. <laughs> All right. So I ink this up in uh, Bermuda Bay. And now today I'm seeing water with that stamp. Sometimes I'm seeing mountains. Yes. And sometimes I see a poop emoji. I do see a poop emoji. <laughs> I absolutely see a poop emoji. So now I'm going to turn it around. Little googly eyes. And go this way. Kind of in the triangle to try and just fill out my um, water. So it, I kind of have a full, full scene right there. All right. And then, because, you know, water in the Caribbean and whatever, it's just not one dimensional. Hold on. Now I'm going to use this swiggly, smushy line, and I'm going to use a little island indigo. And I'm just going to go over let me try the line, a couple spots just <laughs> to add. This is like a little poop emoji. <laughs> <laughs> and this, I'm really just trying to add some additional depth and color to that spot. All right, so now here comes the magic and the fun. So, now that I have it all stamped, whereas I said one of the cards, the first cards I showed, let's see where to go. This one, 
was purely just stamping these images on whisper white all done walk away so here I've done it on the watercolor paper but to add to make it more bold and bright I'm going to use my aqua painter oh, I do need this white gloss so this is our aqua painter we could they come with two different sizes and there's water in the the base and I'm just going to start with one color and I'm just going to oh, add water look at you and blend that that's all in. awesome and it kind of really just makes that color oh, I pop. love it and I'm just going to kind of go over all the surfaces can we let me see there we go all the little surfaces to really make those colors pop and I'm purposely sticking, like I'm going to do all the old olives. And then now let's, we'll do the sun here. And let's see, I'll do the, the palm oh, fronds. I love it. Palm fronds. The base of the, um, now our beach. Mm. Oh, the green. I got some grass on my beach. I probably <laughs> teach me. You want to do each section. Too much fertilizer. Yep. All right. That's fine. <laughs> it's just a new design. Well, we <laughs> can tell fix myself. anything. Yeah. So now I'm just going to add in my water. Yeah. So normally when you watercolor, you do depth. Stay away from connecting sections until each one dries. But that's fine. We have grass. Little beach grass. Okay. Janice says it's 11 degrees in Germany. Boy, we have the entire world covered we today. Do, we do. All right. So now, Saskatchewan, Germany, Dubai, oh, Hawaii. Oh, goodness. All right. Oh, so now I'm just going to assemble. Places. Let me take you out again. So I have crumb cake. And this is, I had to bring it with me. I knew I'd forget the name. So this is the Bermuda Bay. Oh, that is just beautiful. Stitch satin ribbon. That is just beautiful. And I, I love that card going to wrap this around the center and add a little snail. I'm really not paying attention if I am if I'm in the center. I think I'm close. And we have snips of some sort. I have uh, not snips, but those will work. Ribbon scissors. Yep. I'm purposely making Missing the joint ribbon scissors. Yeah, in the middle. Um, so that it'll be hidden by my, um, rest of my card and where did the dimensionals go? Oh, they're, they're hiding behind the, over there. Yeah. Behind there the, they are. Behind the silicone right. mat. I'm going to build this differently from how I normally Happy will. Happy birthday, just, Linda. It's she wet. says she wishes she was on the beach today oh, celebrating her birthday. I do too. We wish we all were on the beach today celebrating your yes. birthday. Yes. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? Stamp and scoop live from the beach. <laughs> okay. So uh, Lenora says you can, uh, if you're quick, you can use a tissue to soak up some of that green to, to fix your mistake, which you could do. I could, but I'm, I'm living with it. Honest with you, I kind of like, like it. It, it kind of looks like it's part of the. Yeah, I'm just leaving it. Now normally I would attach yep, the watercolor it. to this first, but I'm letting it dry. Where's my paper? I'm gonna do this. This is not normally how I build a card. I always attach smaller to larger. I but, agree. I agree. But right from the inside. It's out. wet. So we're, we're winging sometimes it. Sometimes you got, yeah, sometimes we're you just got to go. And, all right, oh, so there's the card. So let me show you how I did my greeting. Oh, yeah. So That's I have, interesting. I like it. I always look for something different. I like right, it. So I think I use Bermuda Bay. Yay, Kim. She says this is the next set she wants to purchase. Oh, good. There is so much potential. I swear this is the, the most versatile stamp set ever. Yep. But our job here is done here. No need, to, <laughs> no need to go any further. We're good. All right. So ink this bad boy up. Here. I'm gonna, now I'm not 100% sure I've even moved. That came out messy. Hold on. I'm going this way now. Yes. Okay. I'm going to go here. All right, there we go. You got to always make sure that your paper is going the direction you need it for the punch. I don't always do that first time. All right, so I think I wanted to point this way. So this is the best badge punch, and I'm going sideways. Oh, and so easy. I'm going to slide this bad boy in here. So easy. And you'll see. 
There we go. Oh, Llewellyn says we make her day. Back oh. at you, Llewellyn. All right, so now what I should have done is attach this before I attach it to the base and cut it. But I never do anything properly in order. So I'm just going to pray I can cut in a straight line. So now I just cut the end of the badge off. And I'll add snail to this. So I'm going to snail to the back. I'm going to line this up. And there is my greeting. Yay! Beautiful. Ta-da! It actually oh, sort of awesome. looks like, but I do. You know what? I kind of. It's like there's grass because there's seagrass, and you know you find that at the beach. That is just awesome. Cool. Awesome. Well done, Linda. I'll stand over here. Oh, okay. Yeah, we have to get used to our new. <laughs> have to get used to our new positions here. So um, that concludes our stamping for today. Cool. A little okay. PSA. Although I lost my cards, I will be doing. Um, two of these. I will be creating two more next uh, on Friday. Friday's live what at time? noon. Someone asked noon. Uh, okay. Noon Eastern Standard Time, um, and I will have a reminder out on Facebook. And this one will probably be next Tuesday. Ooh. So, and they'll probably have more with this one. I'll, I'm Ooh. sure I will have more there to share. Go. But those are a little yep. commercial for what's coming up. I'll be on at eleven tomorrow. I don't know what I'm making, <laughs> so that'll be a surprise. We always love those surprise. Yeah. So we'll see. <laughs> I don't know. I'll think about it tonight. All right. So. With that, it's time for some giveaways. So we have lots of stuff to give away. We're gonna start, we're gonna pop on over to our little giveaway site here. And um, the first set that we have to give away here is the Mary Patterns. This is a rare set, very hard to get. Um, this was in the uh, holiday occasions catalog. Oh, thank you guys for the hearts. Thanks, love, you. love you, love um, you. I, I, I need to restock the stickies <laughs> in here. So this one was an unclaimed prize, so be sure to fill to fill out the prize claim form, which is linked at the in this video's description. And when I announce the winners on the on the the winners page, but also on the Facebook post, I will link to it there too. If you don't fill out the prize, yeah. you got two weeks. two weeks. If you don't fill it out, it goes with somebody else, and you make somebody else really happy. Uh, this is Angel Nielsen. Congratulations, Yay, Angel. Angel gets the Merry Patterns again. Very hard to get this one. It was a host set. And it was only available for a short period of time. Next is the Happy Wishes double box set celebration. This is um, this is a level one, so this was a hard to get celebration two. set. I'm sorry, level two. Hundred dollar one. Level two, hundred dollar set. Um, and this one goes to Luli Mesa Gonzalez. And our last one um, for today's episode before the the replay is this is the box set. Uh, this is the set of Amazing You. And celebrate you thin lips. So these this are two celebration set. items. $150 worth, you know, of celebration. $150 worth of celebration products right there. Bum, and that bum, winner bum. goes to Karen Blonick Ravinsky. All right. Be sure to fill out the prize claim form. It is listed in this video's description. Um, and if you were not Angel Luli, 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 I hope I said that right, and Karen, I don't know why I'm getting tongue tied on that. Um, oops, sorry. You still have a chance to win. Even if you're watching this um, and the replay on either Facebook or on YouTube, be sure to leave a comment and you will be entered into our after live drawing. Um, which was the Happy Wishes stamp set? That, that's not right. Is it's, it? a, it's the it's the perennial birthday. I've got yeah. the wrong stamp set uh, in there. And the wrong picture. And the wrong picture. I'll fix it. <laughs> I'll fix it. Oh, just par for the course, right? I will fix this before we post it. It is the perennial birthday that you're going to be getting. March 13th, we're going to draw the winner for the perennial birthday. And with that, and one 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 note of broadcast at one p.m., uh, our uh, right. sister uh, t uh, Bobby Crouch is on live. Bobby Crouch will be on live. I'll share it on yep. my Facebook page. So, so you want to pop on over there? It's in five continue minutes. Your, continue your continue the fun. viewing. <laughs> All so right. We, so we will see you back here on March thirteenth with episode fifty. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>